Hi, I'm James Grappando. I'm the author of Born to Run. It's my new thriller featuring Miami criminal defense lawyer Jack Switek. Born to Run opens with the Vice President of the United States out alligator hunting um, in the Florida Everglades. He dies mysteriously. And Jack Switek's father, Harry Switek, the former governor of Florida, is tapped as the new vice president, which all sounds great to Jack until he discovers that the vice president's death may, have be, may be tied to a conspiracy and a cover-up that goes back 50 years and that is designed to protect a president who shouldn't be president. Born to Run takes Jack Switek out of his Miami comfort zone, uh, and I did that for a few reasons. One is, I think, it's good to stretch the series a little bit. Miami is a very important character in the Switek series, but um, I want to get out of it every now and then, and I've done it in the past. With Hear No Evil, I took Jack to Cuba and Last to Die. There's a, an adventure with him and Theo in Western Africa. Secondly, I also knew that the uh, Switek family political um, story hadn't been completely told in The Pardon. Um, there was a bit of Florida politics in The Pardon, but I always knew there was another chapter to be written and then along came Hillary and Obama recently in real life politics and as it happens I wrote a book called The Abduction ten years ago about the first black man to run against uh, the first white woman running for president um, and there was a lot of it renewed interest in that story and that sort of rekindled my interest in the Washington based thriller and decided now's the time I'm going to take Jack Switek and Harry Switek to Washington. Fans of the Jack Switek series know that Jack and his father Harry have had their differences over the years and it really started with the first novel in the series, The Pardon, where Jack was this sort of young and aggressive criminal defense lawyer who defended death row inmates and his father was the law and order governor of Florida who signed more death warrants than any governor in Florida history. Um, that was the philosophical difference. There are personal differences that stem from the fact that Jack's, Jack's mother died in childbirth um, and really never knew much about his mother's identity and cultural background and so forth. It's a, a story that plays out in a book called Hear No Evil. Um, and the series itself has been sort of this natural sort of working out of these personal and philosophical differences between father and son. And I'm sure we'll see more of that in the future, but where it'll go. Um, I don't know at this point.